My father was an absentee father when I was growing up. Naalala ko noon, mga four or five years old lang ako, sinabihan ako ng nanay ko na magmano daw ako sa isang lalaking di ko kilala. I looked at this person and I could not recognize him. He was not a familiar figure at home. So I was surprised to learn that this strange guy was my father. You know, I did not have a strong father figure when I was growing up. My dad was an absentee father while we were young. I, I didn't think it would affect me very much. But I have to admit that I struggled with being a father myself and I had my own children. Early in my marriage, I was an absentee father to my kids just like my dad. It took a lot of time and effort to recover whatever time I lost with my kids. There have been thousands of studies done in various countries on the effects of the absentee father on children. These studies reveal the staggering range of issues that children suffer when their father is not around. These issues include children suffering from depression and various mental health issues, college students dropping out of school, teens getting involved in gangs, uh, drugs, and even criminal behavior. Suicide rates are also higher among children of absentee dads. There have also been studies on the effects of fathers who may be physically present but are emotionally absent. Kasama sa bahay pero parang wala din dahil there's no engagement or involvement sa buhay ng mga anak. And this is quite disturbing. They found out that the effect of the emotionally absent father is almost identical to the effect of the physically absent father. The father may be physically present in the family, but his non-involvement was like telling his children that they are not worth his time. This causes a deep sense of rejection on the part of the children. A son grows up without a role model on how to be a man. Daughters grow up not knowing how to be treated right by a man. They have feelings of low self-worth and they hold negative views of themselves. They feel they are not good enough for anything. They are not worthy of being loved. As a result, studies have detected a, a pattern of high failure rate of marriages among grown-up children of absentee dads. The impact is staggering. The situation seems hopeless. But it will reassure you to know that even though men may fail as fathers, there is a loving Father in heaven who is willing and able to cover up for whatever fathers lack in being fathers to their children. The book of Psalm attests to this. Psalm 68 declares this truth. Father of the fatherless and protector of widows is God in his holy habitation. There may be deep wounds that absentee fathers have caused in the hearts of sons and daughters, but we have a healing God who is able to heal those wounds and allow children to overcome their deepest hurts and pains. I thank God that He healed my own relationship with my own father. So ngayon, kaya ko na siyang yakapin. Kaya ko nang maging kaibigan at ituring siyang tatay. So if you are one of the millions of kids who didn't have a father growing up, and you feel you've been deprived of the love of a father, I encourage you to look up and call on your father in heaven. He loves you unconditionally. And if you are a father yourself and you fail to be physically or emotionally present for your kids, all is not lost. You have time to recover lost time. Commit to be present in the lives of your children from here on. Ask God to help you do this and to do so faithfully. Remember that in overcoming the effects of absentee fathers, and in receiving the healing that our Father in Heaven gives, faith matters too.